Hey dudes, how's it going? More single draft for you. A pretty nice draft once again of Lich, Lifesteal and Phantom Lancer. Lich and Lifesteal Ten always appearing for me. I don't know why. Either way, it's, it's all PL over here. We are doing Phantom Lancer. Five seconds. What did you get? Oh, Claire's going um, undying. Nice. I didn't have to turn around to look at Claire's screen to see that. I could have just looked up there, but no worries. No, I've seen you play Undying fine many a time, so... Better nope. get ready. It is fine. Snowball me, you bitch. Right. Someone's having technical difficulties. No, do not DC straight away when I get drafted fucking Phantom Lancer. You better fucking come back. Um... Yeah, this is I, I like my starting build of Phantom Lancer like that. You see, I always expect people are gonna seriously chew me the fuck out for getting a Quelling Blade on like edges and shit like that, rather than a Stout Shield. But my theory is, hopefully, the support is doing me a good service, so I don't need the Stout Shield or not as much anyway. I just have serious problems on agility characters um, lasting in the first like two or three levels, so I like the Quelling Blade just to offset it a little bit. 30 seconds to show time. Um, yeah, 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 come with me, definitely. Oh, fuck Lion. He's DC'd anyway, fuck him. There we go, he's back. <laughs> I d no, no, it's fine. I do like Lion as support, but at the same time, I'm not going to have turned down Undying as support neither. Unfortunately, guys, I've got a new HUD, but the HUDs seem really wobbly at the moment. Like, you can see at the top, it's a new HUD, and down this bottom right, it's a new HUD, and, and then over off. this left bit, it's the old one. But Claire's is usually not working, but now is. It's just, just typical, really. High hopes for this one. Yeah, Claire's got the Radiant Hood and I've got the Die one, as you can see from there. Sharing the Bastion announcer. Claire sharing the Radiant Hood skin, I'm sharing the Die one. Oh, we're bringing the bling. But Phantom Lancer, guys. First skill, Spirit Lance. It slows him a little bit um, for about three seconds, yeah. Does a bit of damage, also creates a clone, which does a bit of damage and other shit like that. Pretty solid, epic range on it. Let me just, uh, get his last hit. His second skill, Doppel Walk. You go invisible instantly and it creates another clone. You can do some confusing shit where it also allows you to escape and initiate and all kinds of different weird shit. Very, very solid. And um, juxtapose, a passive. When you're auto-attacking, you get a chance to create a clone. Your clones also get that chance to create a clone as well. I blame talking though. Cat fight. Cat fight. Come on, you bitch. See, Quelling Blade just allows you to take out with towers as well. No, I can't do no about that. Our numbers grow. But yeah, just to pose, you've got a chance on either yourself or bitch, on or clones to. No, 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 that was the fucking creep. A chance on either your auto attacks or your clones auto attacks to create another clone up to a maximum of um, two, four, six, or eight clones. One sec. Sorry, I don't trust Cole. I really fucking don't. That's Keeper of the Light, by the way. This guy. He has an incredibly awesome lane nuke. It rinses the creep wave. Ideally, you don't want to be doing that as him looks. Your carry will get pissed if you're taking all the CS. But it's just really a menacingly damaging. Um, yeah? Oh yeah, okay. No, I'm not, I could use a bit of mana and get that, but fuck it. It's that thing that's charging there. That is... If he does that on the... Um, no use crying over spilt blood. Like, outside the tree line, it's fucking nasty. You won't know it's coming, and it'll sting like a bitch. Fuck it. Let... Bottom is missing. Come on, it. There we go. Yeah, if he's like over there and he shoots it in, you don't know it's fucking coming. It's just gonna rinse. Like that. There we go. Case in point. Just like that. But what I like to do on my Phantom Lancer is actually really make him a fucking Lancer. Oh, I wanted that. Make him a, a good solid Lancer early game. Yes. One, two, mine. See, the Quelling Blade just makes the difference, makes it a lot easier. There it is. Run, 
Oh, bitch. No worries. Your bottom towers I think spot. I've got enough for my trunk boat. Oh, I must be damn close. Fucking is. I'm waiting here. Oh, is the right cat fight going down? Holy shit. Epic. Do they know I'm here? Yeah. Hello, douchebag. How goes it? Have a, have a whack. I mean, better. Uh, oh, what? I thought I'd get out of the way. That don't matter anymore, anyway. That's not a pot, fool. I guess it only cost him an auto attack to do it, like, but still. I wish I had mana. He yeah, if I had mana, he were dead, though. Fucking hell. Cost me a CS, did that. You see, even when you hear it, it's still like, hearing it's one thing, getting out of the way, is an entirely other. Oh, attack for the win! For the lose! No, it's no, for the win again. Oh yeah, and his ultimate, guys, is... Stop out attacking full. Is uh, Phantom Edge just um, gives him a bit of magic resist and um, extra chance to fucking free, cl free clones to replicate and shit like that and... Yeah, that's about it, really. Pause. It's basically the exact same as juxtapose, it just increases juxtapose. Your illusions can come- I mean, that's the whole point of juxtapose, it creates illusions, and the uh, ultimate just makes it so you've got a greater chance to create illusions. It's like, okay, it's good though. Bitch, don't really matter. Ah. No, that's alright. But what I do, like I say, I get me um, a trunk boost just to give me some lane survive and shit like that. But really, I mean, I like to rush Soul Ring, but you can't finance the um, the, the health cost of it without the trunk boots. So recently, I've been going um, trunk boots first and then into a Soul Ring. What? My ass. There we go. You did run into it. One shot, mine. Nice, so I didn't think I was going to get that. Easy now. No. No. There we go. Easy. Now, I'm at that one as well. Yeah, give me it. Right. No, I think it's 800 foot solar ring, actually. No, what, what am I doing? What the fuck are you doing? Nice. It's alright. For some reason, I got stuck around a load of shit. And um, it stopped me from getting the kill, but I got a decent assist on that anyway. And I've also got my soul ring. There we go. In fact, um, take a TP. Oh, I was fucking using the courier. Just. Oh my god. Honestly, I'm fucking tempted to go back and get that fucking soul ring. Going for broke. Yeah, you know. No, 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 no. I'll put. It's up to you. Such simple mind. Cheers. That'll certainly speed up a little bit. There we go. Trunk boots. Right, give me that fucking soaring. Middle is missing. It's not a bad service for Undyne to upgrade the courier, to be honest. I mean, it's semi-support anyway. It's not fucking carry, really. Certainly, um, I, I, I mean, I've done it plenty of times on Undying, and Heroes similar, similar overall. I think it's just, yes. I didn't even get a chance to finish that. <laughs> I'm getting a decent fucking CS going on here. Too like. How god! <laughs> Purple as fuck. No. Oh, dear. that was fucking fast, wasn't it? Oh, man. You blew it! You had all the chance in the world and you blew it! Effortless. It's kind of funny how they're more scared of us than what we are of them. Nice. 
close. There you go. Missing bottom. Oof. Big fucking Shinko Adokan down fucking corner. It's good. Hey, it was an arrow there. Back look. Fucking hell. Hey, oh, there's a fucking arrow here. <laughs> I just fucking saw it like dirtying its way across the bottom of my screen. I'm like, hey, oh. Fucking dirty ass Marana. Well, that's why I get the Soul Ring, guys. It's not only awesome, I fucked up there. I um, threw my shit down on Marana. I could have actually killed Slark if I'd have shot it at him. To I was still kind of laughing at Ayup. It wasn't funny to me until you laughed. Poor creature. Ayup, but there's a fucking arrow there. What the fuck? Stop that shit, bitch. Oh, I had a feeling about that. I'm just entirely on fuss now. You can just fucking keep but soaring. By the way, guys, it chews a little bit of your health. What the fucker? That chewed a lot of my health. It chews a bit of your health and gives you mana temporarily. If you don't use it in time, it'll take it. Oh my god. Oh, what a dodge! <laughs> he says in quote marks as he doesn't actually dodge it. No, it's fine, I've got tramp boats in less than nine. Fuck, you see what I mean about. Look at that, guys, it's just a constant wave of assault. If you're fighting a good call, it's very, very fearsome. He's doing his job, though, he's firing those fucking. See what I mean? He's firing those fucking beams out. I'm, I'm gonna go sort this fucking twat out in a second. You wanna come with? Oh, then again, you're incredibly low. Sickest guy firing shit out of me. Uh, then again, he's probably warded it down here, hasn't he? Probably is where he's gone. And then again. It's not warded the actual um, the camp, though. I'm, I'm gonna start throwing them out onto him until he fucking... He might... Yeah. Sorry. I'm sure he's fucking charging. Gotta show him not to fucking mess. Well, that's the problem. Um, Keeper of Light gets mana back consistently. You timed that wrong, mate. So, um, I don't really care about killing him. It really does not bother me. My job is to just fucking farm. I don't give a shit about the kills on him. If I can, great. We feel the rush. Juxtapose now. See, I like to raise me, um, my fucking spirit lance. It's called Phantom Lance after all. But I like to raise my spirit lance first. <laughs> Such it's just so you can kind of like do some harassing lane and uh, like, like I was doing there, like the lances were stopping them from getting too cocky, they don't want to get hit by it. And then after that, once you're starting to get higher level and get some more gear, then you break out the um, Get out of here. Then you break out the um, the juxtapose, start building some clones up. I'm not sure what I can do for you. He's level 6 as well, no doubt, innit? Didn't check his level, but I do assume so. Hey, Oscar's got uh, Tusco in it. What the fuck? What were you expected to do for you? Somebody's cooking in there. <laughs> I had no idea who was going in there like that. I just saw a fucking snowball appear. Well, that's why I didn't want to go anywhere near Bane. I, mean, I thought, yeah, it's at least six. Apparently, Claire informs me that Bane is actually a level 11. And it's like, it's, it's 12 now. Fuck that noise. Get that shit out of my face. Lion, that's my CS. Effortless. 
But you see what I mean about the trunk boots and the soaring guys? Just... It makes a big fucking difference. I should fucking whack your mana fucking draining creep for what you've been taking my CS. Oh wait, is your... No, your tower's not down. Return! Motherfucker. Actually, can I get my diffusal on? There we go. Quite happy how this is going so far. We've got a fucking fierce farm going on. Not that far off a diffusal blood. Considering I've already got soaring and trank boots, I'm quite happy with this. That nature's profit bullshit, man. Your mid tower ain't doing too well. Oh, mid tower's not doing too well. Lion! Seriously. Lion, in that case, yeah. Oh, hey up. Hey up. <laughs> Middle is missing. Cottle is, I mean, Cottle's one of my fave supports as well. I really like him. Very, very aggressive. And that's how I play, very aggressive. She fucking wishes. That's double damage, is that? She got haste bottled or something like that. Oh my god. A double deed fucking... It's actually not double D anymore, is it? Double damage. Anyway, anyway. Well, you know what? While they're all fucking down at mid, you got a call coming down lake as well. Missing bottom. No, he hadn't decided to stay with me. Yeah, I didn't see what he did. <laughs> you seem happy about that. <laughs> Eek. Heal that creep. Almost feel bad <laughs> for your top tower. It's not alright, it's obviously accidental, isn't it? Blade. And you've done a fucking great job for me down the bottom, between undying and world. um a, a lancing. Cause like I say, a lot of folk will raise their juxtapose for your ultimate at 6, so there's some synergy. But to be honest, I'm still farming by like level 7, 8, 9. So I don't need the fucking clones yet because I don't want to push the lane. And I'm not going to be fucking fighting that many people if I can avoid it. And in fact, you can avoid it. You Phantom, Phantom Lancer, just go invisible with Doppelwalk. Very, very um, simple. So I like to go like aggressive lancing early on. I mean, you see the damage that I did to um, keep it alight, it's just fucking. It hurts, does that Q. And now that I've got the. Um, Diffusal Blade, I, I quite often say, actually, on a few of the carries, like Ricky and. Um, especially. Phantom Lancer. Once I get Diffusal Blade, GG. It's not quite that bad, but still. No, no worries, Claire. But yeah, I do like to get cocky like that. Like, oh, Diffuser Blade, GG. While well, they're all busy dealing with that mid shit. Yeah, I've got you. <laughs> I was gonna say, I was gonna say, about I've got you. Oh, wait, what, you dead? Um. <laughs> Yeah, nature's profit. I'd say it's like, no, I was looking and there was nobody nearby. Next time I look up, you're fucking dead. Like, hmm. That's one dead cottle, bitch. No point running that way. Somebody's on a roll. He's so good, his Phantom, La uh, Phantom Lancer guys, he really is. One of my faves. He's very, very strong. This is what I'm saying about my single draft recordings recently. I keep getting a lot of my favourite characters coming out. Very, very lucky. Saying that, a lot of the Dota characters are fantastic, so... <laughs> yeah, 
there's very few heroes that, I mean, Morphling's one of the rare ones that I actually slate for being a bit meh. A bit, bit meh. And Drow and Undying's a little bit too strong. A lot of folks say that Phantom Lancer is on the same level as Drow as well, actually. For being that, just that little smidge of being a bit too strong. Although, no, I, I think people put Phantom Lancer on the same level as maybe Undying for being a smidge too strong, whereas Drow is considered incredibly overstrong. Problem with Drow is, she gets a lot of power for basically right-clicking people, and that's what people begrudge. She needs very little work to get a lot out of her. Oh, well. Oh, okay, now we're actually going back in again. Oh, okay, whatever, let's do it. Yeah, actually, um, I could get in on this. Your top towers oh, there's- wait, 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 what the fuck? Nice. It's alright, you did a lot there, Claire. Fucking Sprout and Ice and shit that couldn't move? Get out of here, Slack. You're lucky I didn't turn around and get you then, bitch. <laughs> Diffusal Blade, in case you don't know as well, guys, incredibly strong item. The other fellas couldn't save that. It burns tower. mana on hit, gives you a load of agility and other shit as well, but the burning the mana on hit is incredibly good, especially considering it affects your clones. So all these little fucking clones I'm generating, they're all burning mana as well. So as you can imagine, if you're not on the ball, and you're not trying to get rid of those clones or run away from Phantom Lancer, he's gonna put you in a situation like now, for instance, this Cottle is dead. So dead. Look at him go down. Just like he didn't even exist. See ya! Hey, up, an iron branch. I'm taking that. <laughs> I don't know whose it is. It's owned by Energy, who is on the other team. So that's 25 gold you're not getting back again. Smash, bitch. Oh, actually, let me just, um... Let me just go by the secret shop. I don't know what I'm wanting to buy first. Hmm. I think I might buy a Demon Edge as my first, um, outside of core item. Yes. Demon Edge it is. And I may as well run back to base now, seems as though we've got all those outer towers and shit like that. I may as well run back to base and TP to a tower. Oh, look at all this! There's a lot of shit going down over there. It's gonna be so, it's gonna be a proper bitch in a team fight with Nature Prophet Sprout and fucking Tusk's Ice Ball shit. I'm not quite sure the exact name of his, um... Snowball. No, wait. Ice Shards. Bit of both, eh? I want that ward off you, Claire. That tied on a fucking ward. Yeah. Claire nicely um, give me a tide on the wall, because I fucking love tide on me. And you like your wallet one as well, don't you? The wallet one is very nice, certainly the most blink. Especially with your entire- what, what am I waiting up here for? Oh fuck it, you know what, I'll join I guess. I guess- I guess I'll come- no, you know what, I'll leave- no, I guess I'll come in. God. Looks like there might be something to do here. Hey up, hey up, hey up! Was that needed? Where are you going, Slack? That oh, fuck me. That tower of yours ain't doing so good. I'm not doing very well, sorry. Yeah. Almost feel bad for your top tower. Such power. Too bad about your top right. tower. Ah, oh, fuck top tower. That's where I was gonna go, actually, no but there was such a fucking fight going on. For now. Gotta be careful with Burn. If he gets me into a decent fucking stun, it will fuck me. I don't get stun fucked by him. Run, <laughs> yeah, he's not falling for that. 
Nice! The timing between Bane doing his ultimate and the um, lion stun. That was fucking great timing. Good timing, dude. I think it was entirely accidental, but still. Let, let's feed the ego a little bit. For our cause. Hey up, hey up, hey up, hey up. What the fuck? Oh no. I don't need asking twice me when somebody initiates. It's usually me. That's why we don't need asking twice, but still. Somebody's in this fucking jungle! Somebody's in this fucking jungle! No, 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 no. Somebody's in this fucking jungle. Uh, unless they've gone back. Maybe they went back. Just cleared those two um, easy camps and then went back. Cowards. But Phantom Assassin, uh, Phantom, I keep saying Phantom Assassin, Phantom Lancer guys, very, Bad very strong roll. hard carry, very, very strong lane pusher. This is what sets him apart, he's not quite as hard a carry as, say, like, Anti-Mage or um, Phantom Assassin, in my opinion. In my opinion. But he is a better pusher. Poor creature. He really excels in, like, four of you being in one place and Phantom Lancer being in the other end of the map. And I should have a town portal scroll on me, really, but it is how it is. Why are the creeps coming up here? God damn. Guess I'll just sit here and wait until they eventually get here. Going for broke. Ah, this is on a killing spree. I don't know if I like Slight getting a killing spree. It says me on 505, but still. Oh, here comes Slack. Right. A decoy. <laughs> you hit fucking Slack went after the wrong one. See, so, see the little tricks you can do. I went invisible with Doppelwalk and sent out the clone into the lane like I was still there. Oh, man. And then intercepted him. No mana for you, bitch. Chase this. Seven in a row. We are more able. <laughs> Don't fuck with Phantom Lancer. No. What's going on with? I think I can intercept some motherfucker. Oh no, he's, he's dead. Fuck it. Stay where I am. A decoy. War of Punch! Hey, oh! oh Alright. The other fella's top tower had a little accident. Well, I think that's my, um, Daedalus. It is indeed. Not doing too badly yet. 26 minute Daedalus, Soul Ring, Diffusal Blade, Boots. I'm quite happy with that. 123 last hits? Yeah, not bad. For 7 kills and 6 assists anyway. Quite happy with that. Bags of the courier. Yeah, coin. Yeah. Well, no, I'm... I'm joining... Hey, oh, hey, oh, hey, oh, what's all this shit going down? Why the hell did Marana do that? Yeah, I'm joining up into mid anyway. I was farming my way through the jungle and connecting into mid when the lane gets up here. But it's not too far off, this will do. Look him spawn those clones now, guys. He just fucking goes for it. He's got his constant armor. Hey, up. The fight, fighting tower. Oh, fuck it. I'm getting this mid tower. And while I'm gonna get this mid tower. And while they do the that, fellas lost a mid -tower. I'm gonna go get bot tower. This is what Phantom Lancer does, guys. He, he screws up the towers and he screws up your mana. And then he's incredibly difficult to catch when he doesn't want to be. Very difficult. Such simple mind. And 
why is that not giving me my items? There we go. Daedalus. That was fucking precious time on the tower though. Better not cost me. Nah, I've got it. Nice. The other fella's bottom tower. I don't know how I didn't get the kill on the tower there, but never mind. I think I was too busy pleased with myself that I've just killed a load of people, killed the top tower, killed the mid tower, and then killed the bottom tower. Tier twos. And now I'm working my way on this tower. I'm on the tier three. Oh shit! Chase this. Can I squeeze out that tower kill? Yeah, he fucking got yeah, it. Yosh. Tower's done for. They won't soon forget. Don't start this. nature's prophet. Come on, come on, nature's prophet. I will happily take you. This guy, watch this nature's prophet. Oh fuck. It's just nature's prophet. Run for him. You lucky bitch! You don't want to fucking stay there too long, mate. You lucky! That sprout shouldn't have separated us. It was point blank. He's very lucky. Very, very lucky, sir. It was like a second off cooldown to go in invis, and fucking a second off nuking him again with my fucking spirit lance. And he shouldn't have even split me. It was point blank. I was stood right next to him. And it, it fucking pushed me out with a sprout. Usually I'd be like locked in there with him. He's very lucky. He's got a fucking Dagon as well. Dagon, even level 1 saved him. He's lucky there. He won't get lucky again. Right, let's just improve the base shit now. I need to run faster. And I also need to upgrade my Diffusal Blade because I've almost out of charges on it. But I need to run faster. I also need the Mame. I'm gonna say I'm not, I've not deviated too much from standard by getting a Sasha and, um, Sasha and what am I on about? I always do that Sasha, Sasha and Yanj. I always do that rather than Sanj and Yasha. Always do that. You know what? I was quite happy to farm and if I actually yeah I'm I'm gonna go fucking bottom again. I'm gonna get those racks. Five in a row. I could show you on any carry guys about staying with the team and you know getting the kills and shit like that. This is Phantom Lancer. He doesn't operate like that. He operates on a push build. He does, doesn't he? Literally, like, Phantom... It's like, if you're ever demanding, like, Oh, come on, Phantom Lancer, go with the team. It's like, that's not what Phantom Lancer does. He excels in split push. And you can go with your team, obviously, and I have done. That's why I've got kills. But, you know, it's everything. It's the split push that he really excels in. The Dyer went and fortified their structures. They'll come get me now. I've got to. Let's get there. See, this is what I was saying in an early video, guys. Range racks. I don't know if I've got time to get the melee ones down, so I get the range ones. The other fella's bottom racks is finished. Turns out I we'll probably do have time to do it. The other fella's top yeah. tower won't be making trouble. But I didn't know more. that. You'd have thought that'd come stop me from getting this racks, but apparently the team fight's more important. The other fellas will have to do without their bottom racks. Right, now it's John to team fight. What the fuck? It's got some bullshit on her. Oh no! I'm in a nightmare! Cheers, dude. Could have sworn you were. Everybody just said the same thing as well. It's like, Claire's not a dude! <laughs> it's like, no shit, but... It's actually undescript. You can be, um, you can be a lass and be a dude as well. It doesn't matter. I'm actually, I'm um, not gonna push my luck in there. He better not. Oh my god! I am so fucking angry at Nature's Prophet. Killed me and then killed you. I'm fucking mad at that guy. Yeah, my only death to him. I was taking the piss, at the same time he got jammy with a sprout that separated us. Okay, I've died eight times. I'm dying by 
you're doing Joffet team though. Yeah, you got 13 assists, what are you complaining about? We are beside ourselves. Sprung. <laughs> oh really? We are beside ourselves. Really? 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 Your hopes? That was um, a bit aggressive by me and unneeded, but at the same time, who gives a they shit? cannot kill all of us. Actually, do I have a... Oh, no, not yet. Oh, yeah, I do. There we go. Mere coins are worth this? Dust. I got stunned by Marana's fucking thing. I was getting AoE'd by Slack. Fucking Cottle shows up with some dust. It's a team effort. It's fair enough by them. No, they didn't do much easier. It's just, I mean, I was too aggressive and fucking about and the um, their team is like, we need to seriously fucking work together. Not like it matters at this point. It's over. Oh, shit, yes. Set me the fuck up. No, they're fucked. They are really burned. There's nothing you can do. I am way too far gone. Double damage. I mean, I can counter. See, nature's prophets relying on sprouting me. I can counter him with a pack of tangos. in a row. Counter him PCs with some tangos. Yeah, don't forget that, guys. You can use your tangos, the same things that you do, you eat trees for elfin in the lane. You can use that against Nature's Prophet Sprout as well. So th the thing is, kill me with twice. I could actually count for 90 gold. The other fellas mid rags. And I'd still, I still have change left. The other fellas mid rags. I don't fucking care. I'll Look like push we got a case of the mega creep. Not that time, bitch. What are you gonna do now? Oh, you're going invisible, that's what you're doing. Oh, now he's dead, yep. It's getting over here. Nothing left of the other fellow's mid tower. He's not getting that for free. But say he's not getting that for free. Lucky bitch. Yeah, about to say. He, uh, it might have got you, but it was not for free. You paid for it. <laughs> Doesn't matter. He's dead. And so is the ancient. We'll play it all. That's a win for GG. Shows you the power of Phantom Lancer there, guys. Like, the only time I died was pissing around. It took either... I think that was a four. It took either me fucking about and being overconfident, or just not caring to die there. So if you didn't play in a pro match with him, he's very, very, very strong. He gets an awesome farm. Very, very easy to farm him. Very hard to die on him. He carries very hard. He split pushes very hard. He's just very hard. Period. Very, very, very strong carry. Won't carry as hard as um, some carries. I think he's on the same level as Slack, personally. Although Slack can be a bit more mischievous and a bit... I don't know, Slack's pretty hard. But Slack doesn't actually need as much farm, I don't think. But... He's very strong. It was a slightly weird build there as well. A lot of folk like to give him heart. Heart of Tarask. So when you go in Viz, he regenerates a shit ton of fucking health and comes back with full health. In my opinion, he'd been better off playing Slark at that point. Slark does a similar deal to that. It's making him a bit like Slark, I guess. When you take him with heart and you try to go in Viz. Me? 
I like to front load damage. I like my clones to hurt. I like to hurt. I like to spirit lance them, get in on them, and basically, by the time the mana's drained, they're not far off dead. That's how I like to play them. You just basically drain all their options, and they can't cast anything on you, and then you're free just to auto attack them down. It's very, very strong. Of course, it's strong. One of the best things in any game, I don't care what game, first person, RTS, um, fighting games, what's the most powerful universal ability between every one of those game types? Options. The more options you've got, the more options you can eliminate from the other player, the better. That's why mana drain is so fucking deadly in this game. Because you remove all the options, don't you? Don't you? Pretty much all four skills, use, not all four skills, depends. But, you know, like, generally at least two to three average skills you've got use mana. If you remove their mana, you remove their options, you dramatically weaken that character. You relegate them to auto-attack purely, and obviously depending on the character, I mean, their auto-attack could be great or it could be shit. And either way, losing the skills is crippling. So Diffusal Blade is an incredibly... I don't think it's underrated, I just don't think it's overrated as much as it should be. It's incredibly awesome. The fact that it's got a purge on use is just, what the fuck? Did it really need that? I don't think it did. I, th I think it was strong enough as is. But do not underestimate Diffusal Blade on a character, guys. As far as I would if I see an enemy team guy and he's got Diffusal Blade, he's the one that dies first. It's just, I hate that item. I really, I love using it. I hate fighting it. It's really, really strong. Especially on characters that can hit you without actually being up close and hitting you so you can't retaliate back to them. Because like I say, I can shoot a clone off to him with Spirit Lance. That clone starts replicating. I'm invisible this entire time, or not even anywhere nearby. And they, they by the time I want to get nearby, they've lost mana, they've lost options. And that's the strongest setup you're ever going to get when you go into a fight and they've got no mana. You're not going to get a better setup than that unless they're on like one hit point. In which case, one auto attack's going to do it, but... A very strong carry, with very strong itemizations and a lot of options to itemize them as well. Like I say, you can go like Crit, you can go Heart, Sanjin Yasha and stuff like that. You can go like um, regular boots or Trank boots and Soul Ring. You don't have to get Diffusal, but I do recommend it. He's got a lot of options, a very, very good, very strong character that you can play in a variety of different ways and different aggressions, split pushing, staying with your team. Recommended, in other words, guys. Recommended. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed that, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time. See you dudes!